is set to complete the construction of the highest railway bridge by August 2022 in the Union Territory of Jammu and Kashmir. After the appointment of the new Lieutenant Governor Manoj Sinha, the government of Jammu and Kashmir has now announced special incentives for the completion of impending projects. Recently, it was reported that the Lieutenant Governor Sinha was informed about railways being directed to complete construction of world's highest railway bridge of 359 meters over River Chenab. When will this project be completed? When can we see the first railway crossing this bridge? Uh, that for, the project will be completed in, in, on, uh, very recent. In the coming four months, uh, it will be completed. The arch span uh, on one year, within one year, it will be completed. So, and, any uh, deadlines, sir? Deadlines, you can speak actually, it will be around uh, in 2022. So this will be the railway bridge is being built in the Union Territory of Jammu and Kashmir's Resi district. The bridge will be connecting Katra and Jammu to other parts of the Kashmir Valley and will also help reduce the journey time to capital Srinagar by five to six hours. The bridge covers a distance of 1.3 kilometers and is said to be 34 meters higher than the Eiffel Tower. The bridge is engineered to withstand an earthquake measuring more than seven on Richter scale and wind speed of over 266 kilometers per hour. This uh, rail, this particular bridge which we are talking about will be one of its kind because uh, you, can, you saw that it has a very beautiful helipad as well. So what will happen is people who want to come from Delhi maybe they can catch an air, they can catch a flight and come to Kodi via chopper it will also be one of the one of the boost in the tourism the second is the local employment it will generate because of the tourism hectic activity which will happen connected to this like the local handicrafts local fruit or horticulture whatever can be given to the tourists the third and very important is that this entire bridge connected to the all the track stations they are going to boost the local economy because uh, the stations when they are established a lot of things, the skilled and the unskilled labor connected, a lot of things come up. So uh, the entire population of my district is very eagerly waiting for uh, after this uh, bridge gets commissioned. The Asi district in Jammu and Kashmir is famous for its Vaishno Devi shrine and attracts massive number of tourists throughout the year. Experts believe the completion of the bridge would increase inflow of people into the valley, which in turn would also increase economic activity, boosting local businesses. Also bringing us a ground report from the bridge construction site in Jammu and Kashmir's district is our principal diplomatic correspondent Siddhant Sibal. Let's listen in. This project is something that has been the focus uh, of the government and uh, the government uh, uh, wants to expedite it now and wants to make sure that the valley is connected with the rest of the country through this mega project. And it's not easy to build such a mega project because the terrain is harsh and it requires uh, not only patience, of course, but also requires a lot of determination to build here. And the fact that India is building this project shows India's determination to increase connectivity in the union territories of not only Jammu and Kashmir but also in Ladakh and we know that both the union territories are border uh, union territories in terms of sharing borders with countries like Pakistan and uh, China so once this project is completed this will help uh, in transfer or transport of uh, uh, supplies to to border areas uh, amidst we know how they there has been an axis which has emerged between Islamabad and Beijing, both trying to foment problems at the LAC, which is line of the actual control, and LOC, which is line of control uh, with Pakistan.